Hello, this is Tom King. I'm a storyboard director on SpongeBob SquarePants. And this is Luke Brookshire, storyboard director on SpongeBob SquarePants, and we are watching Goo Goo Gas. <laughs> what? Who could that be? I don't know. It's Plankton. In a pepper shaker. Next time, wear a disguise. Yes, this is the episode where Plankton tries to steal the formula. Oh, that one. I've never seen that one. It's a good one. Wow. SpongeBob! Three, two, one, launch. You can pretty much do anything with SpongeBob, as long as it's funny. I hope that was funny. This is a really nice bit with uh, hammering the point home with babies being helpless by showing not the best mother in the world here. Yeah. Render him helpless. Oh, look at you. You're so small, tiny, and helpless. Hey, I resent that. Huh? Why, you're so tiny and helpless. I could take your formula whenever I wanted to, and you couldn't do a thing about it. <laughs> This fish has control issues, obviously. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I think originally we had it where uh, she takes the bottle from the baby a few times and then leaves with the baby, and then a, a woman comes up and says, Hey, where's my baby? <laughs> it wasn't even the kid's mother. I wonder why that didn't get through. Yeah, I can't imagine. Well, again, look, it, the woman, it's still the, the child's mother, but as you can see, her bad behavior has influenced other people. Specifically Plankton. Mm-hmm. This uh, phone booth gag, too. This is going to go over really good in the next few years. <laughs> yeah, what's that? Why are they in a box, Mom? What's that thing? Oh, that's a phone. Oh my, where did the diaper come from? Well, um, where did the phone booth come from? All right. Ah, pain. Uh, now our cast joins the uh, ranks of colorful cartoon characters who uh, you get to see their baby forms back when they used to poop themselves. Hmm, yes. You have to have the diaper on them. What we wanted to make different in this one is that the, when they're babies, they're really not that fun to be around. I think they're nice. It's a nice combination of them being cute and hideous in baby form. Right. Like real babies. Yes! My plan is working perfectly. Now that I've turned crabs into a helpless baby, the Krabby Patty formula will be mine. Ah, Plankton, you'll get it this time. Hello. I like the cross-eyed look on Crab's baby back there. I like the police are right there as well. Mm-hmm. Don't really have plankton-sized shackles. Well, they're earnest, but not terribly competent. No. They're trying to do their job. Yeah, like we all are. He wasn't really alone. He was with Plankton, and he's not a baby. It's Mr. Krabs. Plankton turned him into an infant so he could steal the Krabby Patty formula. <laughs> Squidward. Don't know about you, but nice I'm burp to uh, accentuate yes. that. Uh, yes, exposition, exposition and then Squidward leaves. Right. Once he's got the hang of things, he knows when to go. That is not cricket. Plankton, Plankton and his anachronistic sayings. Ah. Uh, cricket is a game played in, played in England with bats. And also a small insect. What I really need is to spray Mr. Krabs and SpongeBob. I'm guessing it wasn't very cool for him to make a reference like that. Oh, he's dismissing her. That's obviously going to come back to, to bite him later. Krabs, are you thirsty? That's it. Drink up. Okay. Oh dear, SpongeBob's going to have to be the daddy. He's taking this remarkably in stride, though. Well, he's a very positive person. This is another one of those basic concepts where uh, Plankton has essentially invented the fountain of youth, e eternal life, and uh, does he use it to uh, you know, gain money that way? No, he just goes on with his petty schemes. Mm-hmm. It's, uh, yes. Evil geniuses just took their genius inventions and uh, tried to get patents for them and go the uh, correct legal route. They could probably make a lot more money. That's true. And, and he has a magic diaper uh, creation, right? It's true. It turns you into babies and gives you diapers. 
or is it three squirts for baby? I like that they still have the diapers on when they're adults. I like the uh, triangular hairy chest pattern on the crabs. Uh, wow. It's I like a bowling that. pins. <laughs> yes, I've got it. There better be something other than bills in here. Plankton peekaboo. <laughs> ah, nice bellows. Yeah. That makes two of us. <laughs> Haven't we all been there? Ah, yes. And speaking, of course, of uh, you and I being in the office together. Oh, uh, yeah, we don't really want to talk about that, do we, Tom? Not without crying. Uh -huh. Tears of pain. Oh. He's all faded, too. He's all faded and lumpy. Mm -hmm. And he's grown a cane. Well, it gives you accessories. We've already established the diapers, so. SpongeBob does like the elderly. There's a, a few episodes where he really gets indignant when you talk to talk down to old people. Well, the, there is that episode where they're uh, selling chocolate, and at the end they go on a date with two um, at, ladies of advanced years. They're non-discriminatory. They're not ageist. Oh, even his socks are kind of faded and falling down. <laughs> Get the Krabby Patty! Get him! Get you! Oh, you good? I... <laughs> Victory is mine! <laughs> you can do it, Plankton. Run. I think this is nice. <laughs> Get off my lawn! Like an old people love to use the word whippersnapper mm -hmm. describing uh, youth. Yeah, it's not anachronistic anymore. It's every old person says it. And again, apparently old people do not like you to be on their lawn. Right after the party, the peeny other party! What? And here he gets his comeuppance oh, for violence. bashing on old people. I, want candy. I hope you've learned a valuable lesson in politeness now, Plankton. Yeah, that was the moral. Oh, wait, we're still going. Can't be the moral. Here's where our science training paid off. Mm hmm. How is he staying up? Suction uh, cups? Sheer force of will. Oh, wait, he's underwater. He might be swimming. I always forget that. I know just the place to get it. See, how could you forget it? Look at that bubble wipe. That's true. What aisle did you get that from? You <laughs> I remember originally writing, tell me exactly how you got that baby. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, that too changed in the process. Find that just he he can endure so much. He I'm is happy a about, truly dedicated person. I'm happy about this, the fact that he thinks the baby powder might be actually made from babies. <laughs> and he uses it successfully in his in his formula, even laboring under that misconception. Now my baby gas can't possibly fail. Just like all your other plans that couldn't possibly fail. Karen's so supportive. There's a good uh, 80s nerd gag coming up when uh, she turns into a calculator. And uh, there's like maybe three words you can spell on a calculator when you turn it upside down. Uh, I think this is probably the most family friendly. <laughs> Everyone say your ABCs. Now when you turn into babies, you stay babies. <laughs> Crabs, catch. Again, I like how gas is written on the side of the gas canister, even though he's the only one using it. He might forget. Well, villains like to label things. It's part of their control issues. Labeling, labeling's important. It's why uh, robbers run around with bags with huge dollar signs on them. Because otherwise, what might uh, be in there? Squidward is uh, a that is a beautiful, baby. beautiful Squidward. I've got to say, uh, uh, I was looking at this episode yesterday, my two-year-old thought this was the funniest part of the episode, hands down. Well, it's one of the things we've never seen with cartoons becoming babies, is the drooling and the... Yeah. 
Yeah. And babies put everything in there. Oh, that's yeah. not a good oh, place yeah, to be. Oh, yeah, that's not good. They all have, like, beautiful eyelashes, though. Yeah, that's that's a few hours in therapy over that one. He's teething on it! Give it here, you big stupid... Here we have the, uh, slightly mm. dual joke of the Krabby Patty formula and baby, and baby formula. formula. Indeed, uh... Plankton hasn't done too good. He made fun of the elderly, and uh, they kicked his butt, and now uh, he's being uh, beaten up by a bunch of babies. Uh, yes, give babies a compressed gas canister. Uh -oh. oh, Plankton. You never win. This is very nice. This is yours, I believe. Uh, he still doesn't have a diaper. No. Nope. 